Okay, enough of that. Hello ladies, so today we're going to be doing swatches on the Fergie collection of Wet n Wild. I only got four colors because these are only the ones that got my attention. So I already did swatches on the Wet n Wild with the lip stains. Um, so if you want to check out that, I'll have that linked down below. But for right now, we're going to be focusing on Fergie for Galicious. So let's see. I got Flawless and Global Fierceness. And then I got Throw and Shade, this one, purple violet one. That's like a purple one, I mean. And then I got Epic, this is the purple violet one. So, let's begin with the swatches. I'm going to be swatching them on my hand, and then I'm going to be putting them on my lips. So, um, lips are clean, nothing on them. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get it to it. This is Throw and Shade. This is it. So it's like, yeah, it's like purple, violet too, like uh, light purple. So let's see how it goes on the lips. And I don't know, it feels kind of sticky and when you like smack your lips together, it kind of like, um, I don't know, it looks kind of blotchy. Like, the color moves around a lot. Like, it doesn't stay put, it looks, ew, look at that. See that? Like, or the stickiness, like it. It's all clumped up together. So, kind of not excited about this now. That's kind of gross. Okay, so, anyways, um, wow, my lips kind of look plump right now. Okay, so, anyways, on to Epic. So, let's see. Epic's like a little bit more, um, yeah, I really don't like the, the formula on this one. Like, it's pretty thick and like clumpy and gross. Okay. So anyways, this is epic. So again, this one is epic. Okay, the next shade is Global Fierceness. This one's more creamier. It's not as thick as the purple ones. But there it is. So they do stain. This one stained my lips pretty good. The global fierceness. So it is a stain. It kind of looks like my lips are bleeding. Ugh. But um, yeah, on to the last one. This one is flawless. Ooh, that's really pretty. So this one is flawless. Okay, so the other the only ones I liked out of the four that I got would be the Global Fierceness and Flawless just because like they weren't sticky just because they weren't sticky and um they just feel a lot better than the purple ones maybe because the purple is a dark color they have to use more um stuff in it I have no idea so it is a stain um it doesn't say how long um they last let me just remove it from my hand maybe you guys can see Okay, so those are the swatches. You guys can see that it did stain. I'm pretty sure this isn't like the Wet and Wild ones, though. I'm pretty sure you have to reapply just because it looks so, um, it's just like really light. Um, you have to build it, but even if you do build it and if you smack your lips like this, you still can see the line where you smack your lips, so it's just kind of like, eh. Uh, overall, on the whole formula thing, I think the formula sucked. Um... Maybe it's good to apply on a lipstick you already have that's matte or something and you kind of just want to give it like a glossy look. Uh, I'm not sure. Maybe you're just a Fergie fan and you just want to have the collection. Um, but yeah, um, it's not that bad. I would give it like a, a 6 out of a 10. Uh, but yeah. Um, 
tell me what you guys think have you guys tried it did you guys like it um let me know your thoughts on it so yeah that's the fergie um, fergie um lip gloss swatch let me know if you guys want me to um like do like a full day review on it to see how long it lasts and stuff um i love doing things like that for you guys so yeah um thanks for watching